So that's how you pull the tile out. Now, um, this has got sarking underneath it, and because the lady's wanting soundproofing done, um, I'm not going to cut that sarking and we'll, we'll go to the trouble of. G'day, Peter here from Comfort Zone Insulation. Uh, uh, I hope you enjoy our next video about insulation. And just remember, if you need a quote, click on the link and uh, we're happy to help you out. Hey, Peter here from Comfort Zone Insulation. And so I'm just up here on this terracotta tile roof. And you can see these tiles aren't cement tiles, they're, um, they're terracotta. Now, when you, um, when you walk on any tile roof, you should walk in the middle of the tile, on that bit there, right on the front edge. And so when you move your feet, you move to the front edge of that tile. Right? Um, and so that's the safest spot to walk on tiles, whether they're concrete or terracotta or whatever. But um, uh, you certainly don't want to be walking in the middle and on these joins because sometimes you'll break a tile walking on the joins um, and uh, uh, but more so with terracotta they're a little bit more fragile and there's a, another little trick they're not like concrete tiles right? so you can lift it up like that it's fairly easy right? so I'm just put that side there hold that up because right? so I'm holding the camera with one hand right? and that there that there there you can see that there will just stick out there, like that. So, so that's how you pull the tile out. Now, um, this has got sarking underneath it, and because the lady's wanting soundproofing done, um, I'm not going to cut that sarking and we'll, we'll go to the trouble of a bit harder to clean up and things. But I'll put that tile back in and we'll, we'll do the job from inside, and, and that way we won't have to cut a hole in the sarking, and, and that'll keep its integrity for sound. So. Okay, so I've just climbed in here into this terracotta tile roof and I've got the hose up here and I'm about ready to start insulating it. So terracotta tiles aren't the same as concrete tiles, these are clay tiles um, and they don't come out the same way. So when we're finished I might show you how they come out but um, they're a bit specialised. A lot of guys try and kick them up, in which case you'll break them. And, uh, and that. But what I wanted to show you is inside this roof space now uh, you can see there we've got the battens running across on top of the plaster and the joists there right but these joists are old hardwood joists and so they're a lot lot bigger than your modern house um, and I'll get to that in a second this has uh, got your um, ducted air conditioning system up here so we'll lift that up and pump underneath it and it's got an exhaust fan there that will put some uh, bats around and uh, and over here, we've got the manhole cover. Oh, sorry. Yeah, so that's, so we're just gonna put a bat over that. So then that's insulated as well. Um, and, uh, but this is what I was saying to you about the height of the joists, is that this is an old house. And see, you've got about a 20 millimeter um, batten, and then another 125 millimeters for you. For your joist height so you've got you got 145 millimeters there so because we're pumping in the insulation to 100 millimeters we should actually be down from the tops of joists when we're finished right um uh, uh it should be 45 millimeters 40 millimeters down from the top of the joist so up to about there right now a lot of people um you know think that it should always be at the tops of joists well if your joists are 100 millimetres, it'll be at the tops of them. If they're 90, it'll probably be over them. And if they're, in this case, 145, it'll be uh, 40 millimetres or 45 millimetres below the tops of the joists. So that's important to remember. And it hasn't meant that the product's settled. It just means that, that your joist heights are a different height. Um, this has got a little drop ceiling down here where this cupboard is. So we'll put some, some bats over the top of that stop any insulation falling down there and uh, so anyway we'll get in and do the job and I'll probably show you what it looks like when we're finished. 